Legislation and regulation can be baffling. Take this week's Omnibus. It's massive. A 2009-page spending bill with accompanying documents. More on that later. A D.C.-based startup wants to help lawyers, lobbyists, and public servants gain insight into all of that. Legalese through a big data analytics program. Diane Cho profiles Fiscal Note. At the age of 23, Tim Wong not only holds the title of chief executive officer and co-founder of Fiscal Note, he's a former member of the Montgomery County School Board, a title he earned before being legally allowed to vote. I actually kind of barreled down the political path um, and decided kind of to shift gears a little bit later and, and study computer science. And so um, when you actually combine these sort of two interests of mine in computer science and, and public policy, you sort of realize that there's a lot of these problems in policy and politics that can be very easily solved through uh, technology. Working out of a Motel 6 in Silicon Valley, Huang and a couple of its high school classmates started their own company. The platform is completely automated. There's not a single human touching any portion of the, the back end of the platform. Everything is software engineered. Everything is completely based off of technology. He says the first product they created called Prophecy allows users to aggregate legislation from across the U.S. and in Congress to understand how those bills are changing. The traditional way of getting this information was actually to try and you know, contract out with K Street firms, lobbying firms, law firms, uh, or hire in-house. He says Prophecy uses a search algorithm in real time that allows users to search a topic, find the bills related to it using artificial intelligence to calculate the likelihood it will pass. The company boasts a 94 percent accuracy rate. It also calculates how likely lawmakers are to vote on a specific bill, which he admits prompts a lot of calls from lawmakers themselves. And I, I've seen lawmakers that are uh, adamant that there's no computer in the world that will be able to kind of capture what's going on in their head. Um, but in a world where we can have, you know, behavioral advertising um, and incredibly targeted micro-targeting of voters and of consumers, it's not terribly difficult to find the profile of one individual person and actually quantify that information. Their second product focuses on the regulatory side. What we do is we surface up uh, all the pending rules and regulations as it pertains to every three-letter agency here in Washington as well as every state regulatory agency around the country. Wong says this form of analytics has no limit. He wants to expand his two-year-old company into case law and go international. For Government Matters, I'm Diane Cho.